Excellent. We have a question, and the question is, what do you mean by jumping in good form? So I'm going to type that in the thing here. By jumping in good form and jumping out of stride. So those are two really good questions and uh, jumping in good form is when to, to be placed in the hunter class the judge watches each hunter go around its course of jumps and scores each hunter round at least I give a numerical score for each hunter round out of a hundred and if the horse has good form over its fences it gets a round of 80. If it has a poor form over fences hangs its knees it gets a lower mark 60s perhaps. If it refuses or does a major error gets a 40. Breaks into a trot if it has a major error. That's what how that's just how I score it. Every judge has a different way of doing it. Some judges don't do a numerical scoring so I do a numerical scoring. A good solid horse that has good form over fences and jumps out of stride means that the horse will canter to a fence, it'll go canter, 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 jump, canter, 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 jump, canter, 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 jump, and it's in a rhythm like this, and each rhythm, each step will be a stride, and if one of those strides isn't a stride, then it's a jump. And I'm sure we've all seen a horse that doesn't jump out of stride, it has, um, it comes down, it does a canter, canter, and then you turn and it sees the jump, it goes canter, 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 and puts in a couple little stubby steps in front of the fence, what we call chips, and then jumps the jump. And for each error or each kind of indiscretion that the horse does in front of the fence, the judge has uh, some sort of hieroglyphic or uh, mark that they put on the page so they can keep track of what that horse did at each fence. So for a horse to jump out of stride and jump in nice form over the fence, they have an even rhythm to the fence and jump the jump in a, out of an even rhythm and when they have good form over the fence, their knees are up and the horse stretches his head and neck so the horse's neck and back and tail and hind legs are in a nice arc and we call that a bascule over top of the fence. Sometimes you'll see a horse where its back is dropped down, his head is up and the back is dropped down and we call that flat or inverted for jumping and that is not a desirable thing and most trainers work so they do not have to deal with horses that are are hollow or inverted when they jump. It's not a desirable thing to see. It's not comfortable and often when they jump in a flat fashion they hit a jump which is not good either. So jumping in good form is the horse jumps with his knees up, rounding over its neck and back and clearing the fence in an out of stride fashion. If the horse has poor form it hangs its knees and that is not very good for a hunter because uh, hunters are based on the the um, old field hunter routine and if your horse had hanging its knees it wasn't a very desirable trait when you went into the field hunt because if it did hit something it would have catastrophic effects so you don't want to hit anything no hitting the horse has to have his knees up so it clears the jump lovely and also its hind legs up so it clears its uh, jump with the hind legs. How's that for an answer?